Today we're going to talk about the latest features of the Material Model Library. The Material Model Library was originally designed to store all of your material models that you created using the CA Modeler. But we've talked to our customers and invariably they have material models that come from other sources and they want to store them on the materiality platform as well. So today we're going to show you exactly how to do so. In doing so, we're actually going to use two of our engineering apps, the My Materials, to actually create the material in the file, and then we're going to upload the file using our Material Model Library. So let's start with the My Materials. We're going to go into here, we're going to go into our toolbox, and we're going to add a new material. Today we're going to be playing with the Invista Torsen G3000 HRBK34. So let's add that to here. And we're going to add as much information as we have here. I know it's a plastic. I even know it's a PA66. And of course, we know who the supplier is. In this case, we're going to be talking about Invista. Now, there's more information that I could add if I wanted to, but for today's demonstration, I'm going to skip past some of these. So now there's my material. And I can add some other information, but again, we're talking about CA models. And we're going to click right here, and it's going to go to the CA models. And now we simply select the material. It's got all that information already. And we can go to the file format. In this case, I know that my file is a Moldflow UDB file. So we're going to go to our Moldflow, Moldflow UDB. We could add additional notes if you wanted to. And then we just simply click the file. So we'll go to our material model library. This is something you have on your own files. I have mine right here, and I'm going to capture this material. And it's again, it's a UDB file. It's already formatted, and I upload. And immediately, I now have that file in my materiality folder. So as I look at my materials, I can now go in there and I can access this. As I go to my material model library, and there it is. I always have mine sorted by the most recent, and there it is. It's my Invista Torsen G3000 BK34 Moldflow UDB file sitting there at the top of our Material Model Library. For more information on the Material Model Library, check our complete series of videos at YouTube slash Materiality. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.